Good morning and welcome back to my channel. I am, why is it turning? Did you guys see that? Um, my name is Leah and it is 8.02. I am exhausted. I've had a bad week. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram or haven't seen my stories, I am trying out new anxiety medication and it is kicking my ass. It is really hard for me to get out of bed. I worked out once this week and that is not very typical of me if you know me. So it is Friday and if you guys know me, Friday is Starbucks day so I'm on my way to get Starbucks and we're going to do a little what I eat in a day. So going to my uncle's house because it's his birthday tonight. We're going out to dinner, um, COVID friendly. I'll f take you guys along with me to see what I actually realistically eat in a day on a Friday. I mean, any day, but Thursdays or Fridays we usually like, go out or order in. So here we go. Let's go get Starbucks. <laughs> The Starbucks ran out of oat milk and the brown sugar, so I switched it up and I did a shaken espresso, but with almond milk, honey blend, two pumps of honey blend, and cinnamon powder. So it's kind of like a flat white, but the shaken espresso version. And then my dad, I got him an Americano. Um, and that's it. It is time to log on to work. I'm running a tad bit late. But it's okay, it's Friday. Let's go do it. I just got home and I'm logged on to work, except for something's being weird. I have to restart my computer. It is not my week. I am so tired. I touched upon it like quickly before. Basically, um, in my last video, I had a doctor's appointment last week and they put me on to try out to, some anxiety medication and it's literally just been kicking my ass like you have to your body has to adjust to it and it's just making me exhausted I'm taking it before bed um, I'm not even taking a lot like I have to work myself up to the amount that I will be taking but I, I have my alarm set every single morning for the same time I usually do and it's just like not happening so it's unfortunate um, especially like I only have two weeks left of being home and having this routine and before I adjust and everything and I wish I wasn't as tired just because I have so much I have to do in the next two weeks but it's either would you rather be exhausted or have anxiety exactly I will let you guys know when the next meal is. It is 10.31 and I am so hungry. I had to finish um, this one project before 12 and I wanted to make sure that I got it done. So I just focused on that and now I am going, whoa. I'm going to make something to eat, but I don't know what I'm gonna make. fridge and stare into the fridge in hopes that something will pop out at you. It's all just the same crap. I'm gonna do like an open faced sandy maybe. I don't know. I'll see where the wind blows me. What I decide. I'm gonna do like, like an avocado toast. That's what we're gonna go with. Let's see what we can get done. Got some sourdough bread. I believe, what is this? 
So it's like a hole. I'm going to make the eggs. Let's heat up the pan. I'm going to slice some tomatoes. My go-to, everything but the bagel seasoning. Avocado. Let's see, do we think it's going to be a good one? I'm nervous because it's a bit mushy. Drum roll, please. Ah, not too shabby. Oh, baby, look at that. To perfection. I need a plate. If you've never seen a perfect piece of toast before, now you have. That is just stuff. Ning. Let's get a fat amount of avocado. I'm going to add some salt, pepper, chili flakes. garlic salt or garlic powder. Then tomato, tomato, egg, egg. This is gonna need a fork and a knife. Bring the hot sauce and let's do this. I like it spicy, yes. Okay. Oh yeah. So, gonna make something. I really want that pineapple, but I don't know if it's good yet. Ooh! We have some leftover. Sushi, and there's vegetable sushi here. Veggie, veggie sushi. Mm -hmm. So good. Their veggie roll, they put carrots, cucumber, avocados, Lettuce and asparagus just kills it. If you guys don't already know, sushi is like my favorite thing. This is your sign to drink water. Go grab a cup, grab your bottle, grab your whatever. How do I know if a pineapple's ready? Alexa? How can you tell when a pineapple is ready? According to WikiHow, here's how to tell when a pineapple is ready. Step one, smell the pineapple. Flip the pineapple over and sniff the stem in. A sweet scent is generally considered the most important aspect of choosing a ripe pineapple. If it has no scent, it's probably not ripe. You can try smelling the pineapple from other sides. A sweet enough scent may be distinguishable from any side of the fruit. You should still be able to smell the scent from the stem end, however, where it will likely be strongest. Avoid pineapples that smell fermented. Although you want the pineapple to smell sweet, you do not want it to be so ripe that the sweet smell has an alcoholic or vinegar-like taint to it. She has more to say. Step 2. Squeeze the pineapple. 
Lightly squeeze the oh, pineapple heavy. using the fingers of one hand. You want the pineapple to be pretty firm, but soft enough that it gives very slightly when you press down on it. Next. Pluck a leaf from the top of the pineapple. While public opinion is conflicted over the efficacy of this method, some people believe that a pineapple is ripe when a leaf can be plucked from the top of the pineapple without too much resistance. To if a resist. leaf comes out too easily, however, the pineapple may be rotten. I don't know, that's just a stupid step. We're cutting the pineapple. Alexa said it's fine. And by Alexa, I mean... For how long? No. Mm -hmm. oh, <laughs> WikiHow said it's fine. The more you know, guys, because I never knew any of that, so... So good. Right. Well cut. So another like side effect to the anxiety medication I heard was like loss of appetite and I do really try to eat intuitively so like I'm not starving right now. Like I'm not so, so, so hungry, but I'm in the mood for like a snack. Yeah. But I feel like I want something more than just pineapple. My, my camera's gonna die. I'll film the rest of my phone until I charge this. All right, I'm on my phone now. I need to buy another camera battery. <sighs> okay, um, focus, pick up where we left off. Off? Pick up where we left off. What do I want? What do I want? What do I want? What do I want? Do I want? <sighs> this is like the notebook where he's like, what do you want? What do you want? That's how I feel right now. I don't know. Ryan Gosling, I don't know. Okay. I wish I did. Just have popcorn. So less or evil. I know what I'm gonna have. I'm bring my pineapple. You guys are gonna be shocked. Dun da da da. Drum roll. Ah. You can't go wrong. Just like, not in the mood for anything big but I'm in the mood for something. I kind of wanted something sweet anyways. This is my, this is my favorite flavor. My camera died and my phone has no storage and won't let me record. All I wanted to say was that this is my favorite flavor and I can't stop eating them. If you follow me, you know, I eat them all the time. It's the oatmeal taco chip one. So if you guys want to get yourself some and have them like I do, you can use my code if you want. It's Lifestyle by Leah with the periods in between, just like my Instagram. Um, and it'll get you 25% off on the gomacro.com website. I literally, I just want you guys to have them too because I love them so much. I'm going to eat that and I'm going to eat the rest of my pineapple. I give up. I'll come back when my camera works. It is almost 6 o'clock. I am dressed to stop at my uncle's and then go to dinner wearing my new pants at the slit this little brown top and my blazer
could be the weirdest, yet the best dessert I've ever created. Granola and marshmallows. Judge me all you want. Don't knock it till you try it. You want to see what all the hype's about? You talking to me? Mm-hmm. Are you talking to me? I'll give you this big meaty chunk because I love you so much. Come here. No, I can't. Come here. Get the granola. Eat the whole... There you go. And what are your thoughts? It's good, right? It's like a s'more. No? What do you give it? Eight out of ten? What would be so bad about it? It's actually really bad. I know, right? I got to crunch down on the cinnamony goodness. Maple almond butter. Curly Elizabeth. You heard it here first, folks. It is mother approved. I left you amazingness, deliciousness. You're welcome. You're welcome. I had my dessert. I had my dinner, my appetizer, my snacks, my snacks, my snacks. My brunch, my coffee. <sighs> Solid. Solid day. I wanted to touch upon that today was definitely um, like full of intuitive eating and everything. I have noticed there's like a spot from my tanner. I have noticed that my appetite has changed a bit from the medication that I'm on for anxiety. But I obviously know I still need to fuel my body. So I like was definitely trying to listen to my hunger cues, but also I stop when I'm full. Like I didn't finish the dessert. I gave some of it to my mom. But yeah, I just try to like listen to my hunger cues, but I have noticed a bit of a difference in my appetite. So like I get fuller faster. I'm not as hungry throughout the day just because of this medication, which is unfortunate. And I know it'll go away. It's just like my body getting used to it um but this was like obviously incredibly realistic I hadn't had a burger in a while and I was honestly kind of craving it when my dad said he wanted it and we split fries that shrimp appetizer was so good and I don't know if you guys think it's weird what my dessert was but don't knock it till you try it like highly recommend so I was an average what I eat in a day when I'm trying to figure out my body and my medication so i hope you guys enjoyed and the next video that'll be up will be the first part of my move-in vlog series so i'm super excited we're officially like 12 days out i think oh my god um we're picking up a couch on sunday so i'll definitely be filming that and going to home goods and target so a lot of fun stuff to look forward to. Definitely hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed already. Follow me on TikTok and Instagram. Both are Lifestyle by Leah. And that's it. I hope you guys had a great weekend because by the time you see this, it'll be Sunday. And I hope you guys have an amazing week. Thank you guys so much. Bye.